Hi and Assalamu Alaikum. Welcome back once again to Technology Information Channel. Today in this video we are going to explain the Caterpillar EMCP 4.1 and 4.2 controller complete wiring diagram explain in these videos before the starting the video a small request to all newcomers if you are first time on my channel please make sure to subscribe my channel and hit the bell notification to getting more latest updates video so let's get started as you can see here today in this video we are going to explain the caterpillar emcp 4.1 and 4.2 controller complete pinouts and complete wiring diagram explanation in this video so let's get started as you can see this is the emcp uh, 4.1 r 4.2 the back side 70 pin connector okay we are explaining each pins where they go and where they connect it so let's get started first of all as you can see the pin 60 and pin 65 this is the battery negative input supply as you can see if we follow this black wire as you can see here is the junction boxes and chest is ground is and all finally this black wire is going to the battery negative post as you can see going to the ch charging alternator and also connected to the starter motor these all are the complete wiring uh, grounded wiring circuits okay understand this is the electronic control module of the generator but we are not explaining the control module we are only explaining the emcp controller wiring diagram okay input and output supplies pin 60 and pin 65 this is the negative input which is coming from the battery in all junct junction all is connected with the starter motor uh, charging alternator chest is ground and also with the battery negative post okay this is the input supply for the turning on to the for the emcp 4.1 or 4.2 okay next pin 55 sorry pin uh, wire wire number 55 and input pin 52 and pin 18 this is the positive input for the emcp controller okay the main supply which is only used to turning on the controller pin 65 is negative which is wire number 2 black wire and pin 52 wire number 55 red wire this is the battery positive and negative inputs as you can see battery 12 volt or 24 volt dc okay next this is the relays for the different purposes okay this is all the programmable relays okay some are pre-programmed and some are need to be programmed for your specific requirement okay this is all the dc dc uh, circuits as you can see pin 51 and pin 61 pin 48 pin 58 pin 35 pin 43 okay one is for the relay number one is for the engine crank relay number two for the fuel control relay number three for air shutoff switch and relay number four audible alarm and relay number five gfr switch and grr switch and also programming optional and programming optional this two need this two last relay number seven and eight need to be programmed for your work this is a spare relay okay how the this relay is connected as you can see this is only internally switches okay you know switches when you give the command to start 
this is only close the internally connection for example real number relay number one engine crank as you can see here is a normally open symbol on which is top of pin 51 and 61 the one side is the pin 55 is input as you can see all the pin 55 is this is the positive jumped positive positive jumped splice all together and provided to the relay number one and also relay number three and relay number four relay number five and relay number six only the relay number two is operated by the negative input okay and pin 51 which is wire number 14 orange color this wire is for the starting circuit okay this is out from the emergency push button nc and then going to the gen co connector 70 way input pin 34 and then out from pin 34 and then going to the another emergency push button which is nc and then out from the nc and going to the smms s1 starter motor solenoid okay and finally going to the grounded side of the starter motor okay now explain relay, relay number two as you can see the relay number two pin 58 is a negative input and pin 41 which is wire 41 is going to directly as you can see here directly to the CR what is mean by CR CR means control relay okay this CR relay is control relay for the fuel system okay and this another relay as you can see the another side pin 55 is coming from the control relay of the fuel and this is finally going to the SR relay okay slave relay okay and this slave relay is one side is grounded one side is a positive feed of the wire 55 battery negative okay and finally this wire is going to the the sensors coolant loss sensors okay as you can see if you were the violet and white wire this is going to the low coolant level switch okay as you can see ASR air shut off relay okay this one this is the connection very simple no move further as you can see the pin 70 where is going the pin 70 pin 70 is a negative output is going to the uh, gen 70 way pin connector pin 30 and then out pin th and insert it to the pin 25 and then out pin 30 for the 25 and then going to jump with the negative okay this is for the emergency push button when this wire is disconnected negative wire is disconnected the controller goes in a emergency mode emergency stop mode now move pin 55 wire 57 remote start this remote start wire 57 is going to the connector remote start contact as you can see 44 and 45 okay this is the negative feed to the pin 55 okay when negative feed is disconnected this is going to start the engine understand and this low cooling level temperature sensor fuel leak earth fault low fuel level and programmable input output and programmable input output okay as you can see here
फॉर एग्जाम्पल लो फ्यू लेवल पिन फोर्टी फोर वायर नंबर सेवेंटी टू वाइट एंड वायलेट वायर दिस वायर इफ यू फॉलो दिस वायर दिस वायर इज गोइंग टू द जिन सेवेंटी वे कनेक्टर इन टू पिन सिक्सटी फोर एंड देन आउट फ्राम द पिन सिक्सटी फोर टू द गोइंग टू द फ्यूल लेवल स्विच ओके एंड द फ्यूल लेवल स्विच इन अदर साइड इज अ chassis or engine ground okay this is the sensor connection now let's move to the ac connection as you can see the pin 67 and pin 66 this is the magnetic pickup unit negative and positive input supply which is directly coming from the mpu and and sorted to the pin 67 and pin 66 okay the wire color is a white and violet and wiring number also mention on it okay and and connected to the gen connector 70 way and uh, pin wire 21 is going to inserted in a gen connector pin 31 and then out from the pin 31 wire number 21 is going to the directly to the magnetic pickup unit and a controller pin 67 and pin 66 okay now let's move to the ac connection as you can see this is the generator four pole breaker or power terminal strip pts optional okay this is the three phase connection okay pin 51 pin 52 pin 53 this is the negative uh, positive uh, sorry three line l1 l2 l3 input to the controller okay understand pin 51 uh, wire number 51 wire number 52 and wire number 53 inserted to the now let's move to the ac connection as you can see three wire is coming from the four pole breaker or power terminal strip pts optional okay this this is directly coming from the as you can see this is the current connection ct transformer current transformer number 1 2 and 3 okay three wire wire number 51 52 53 is directly coming coming from the cities and insert it to the the controller wire number pin pin input 31 47 57 this is the current transformer input of the city uh, city okay and also the all city common is wire number 50 insert it to the pin 39 okay as you can see there here is a Three phases, three cities. L1, L2, L3, three, three phases, and also three current transformer. Okay. S1, S1, S1 is going to pin 51. Uh, wire number 51, wire number 52, wire number 53 is directly going to the controller in CP 4.1 and 4.2 and input and a pin 31, 47 and 57. Okay. And all CT common is. input wire number 50 input in a wire number 39 okay let's move to the ac connection as you can see here three phases t1 t2 t3 and also neutral is directly coming from the bus bar and input wire number 108 109 110 and 101 input in a wire number 13 of the emcp 4.170 pin connector 11 and 9 and 7 vc vb and va understand this is the remote accumulator announcer as you can see here 
the connection of the enunciator. So I hope to watch this complete wiring diagram tutorial videos. If anybody have any further question, any problem, please write comment below in comment section. Okay. Thanks for watching my video. See you all next time. Goodbye.